All right, guys, welcome back to another video. And today I'm really excited to show you guys the newest course from Walkabout Mini Golf called Widow's Walkabout. This is their first um, Halloween themed or horror themed course that people have been asking for from them for a very, very long time. I'm going to show you guys the first uh, eight to 12 holes so you guys can get an idea of how this actually plays here and, and just talk to you guys about this course. I'm really excited about it. So let's go ahead and get into the video. Game in tech. Eating brekkie is the gaming tech. Going for a brekkie is the gaming tech. Gaming tech is the gaming tech. Gaming techie. All right, guys, welcome to Walkabout Mini Golf. I wanted to showcase, obviously, the new course that just came out, Whittles Walkabout. It is their first horror based uh, golf course and stuff like that. People are really excited about it. They've been asking them to do a horror based, um, you know, theme mini golf course in a while and they do a fantastic job i love this game uh their courses are always fantastic i've done a lot of videos about them and they usually come up in my top 25 games on uh on the quest and stuff every time because this game is fantastic um but let's go ahead and get into the course i'm not going to show you the whole entire course so i don't spoil every single thing i'm going to show you the first nine holes and here we go so it tells you to check out the settings for some unique options so let's go ahead and take a look. Oh, looks like we got some spiders. We can leave them on. I don't care. Stroke limit, ball locator, notifications, audio. Everything else is probably the same. It's probably just spiders in case people are, you know, not a fan of it. But let's go ahead and take a look. Look at this golf course, though, right here at the mansion here. Looks fantastic. So let's see what we got here. This is part three. You can see these things are going up and down. Let's go. Oh, almost nailed that perfectly. Oh, we're not starting very well at all. Come on now. Got par at least. Oh, I didn't mean to actually uh, hit that. I love being able to walk around and stuff. You could use the trigger to obviously jump you towards it, um, but I just love looking around everything, seeing all the detail that they put. Um, looks really good. They haven't even optimized for the Quest 3 yet. They said they're going to, but they haven't yet. They did say this, this is going to be creepy, as you can tell here, but this isn't about... Uh, this is like a haunted house, obviously, and stuff, but this isn't about... Um, jump scares or anything like that uh so at least that's what they said i mean obviously i haven't played it we're playing it here for the first time but uh you shouldn't be expecting jump scares from what they said you should be expecting just a like you know a horror themed course and stuff like that all right let's see what we got here really wanted it to continue bouncing but Strike and a miss. All right, all right. Another par. So it looks like we're going to the right for right now. Yeah, look at this. This looks awesome. The detail they put in their courses is just ridiculous. You see how much is going on in this room? I got a bump. I didn't realize the bumps went up that fast. I thought I was going to have a little bit more time. Alright, alright. Another par. Not bad. Yeah, this is just insane. Look at this hole right here. A lot of creativity going on like they do with all their courses. Just gotta stop and stare. And don't forget, you could find the lost balls too. We're not really doing that today. But there's balls hiding everywhere that you can find and unlock on all of these courses. Oh, it slices it right up. 
Oh, that's hilarious. This is gonna be hard. Oh, I almost had it too. Unless if you get it on that, I guess. There we go. Ooh, let's go! I'll take that luck. Too bad that wasn't on the first swing, but I'll take it. That was a par, too. I'll take the luck. Uh, are we going out that, the door? Yep. Yeah, look at this room here. I don't even know what that is. What is going on with this course? You gotta swing all the way around. Oh, that was way too hard. I don't know why I got that excited. Oh my god, we almost made it. You guys saw that? We almost put it in the hole. I'll take the par again. Oh, we're in like the... Look at this room. Look at this room right here. Do you understand how much work this took to make this room just for one hole? Like, this just looks so, so awesome. What a great uh, course to play through Halloween with your friends. And look at this course. You're playing this on top of the chairs that are moving and stuff. That's what I'm talking about with the creativity here. I knew that was going to happen. Is that going to come back? No, it lets me go from right there. Oh, no. Oh, it moves. I can hit it when it comes by then. Oof. All right. Oh, we got a 30. Taking a look at the course and stuff because the detail is just crazy. I mean, looking up there and stuff like that. Now we're outside, we got some wind. It looks like the wind might affect this. I would assume, because the wind is insane. Oh yeah. Oh, we almost had that. I'm gonna get mad about a par. Oh, we got another wind course. Oh, we were so close. No, and it fell off too. Oh, that was such a good hit. Damn, this one, we're not gonna get par on this one. Yeah, this is a lot harder than it looks. Gotta practice this. Oh, damn it. Oh. Definitely didn't get par. Look at out here, though. Look at the lighthouse down there. That's creepy. Uh, did we go in here? Yeah. What do we have going on in here? Oh, this door opens. I go through here so I can see. Oh, where's my ball gonna hit? Oh, we got this thing going on. Oh, 
Oh, that's nonsense. Thirty. I'll take it. Uh, question is, where do we go? Do we go up these stairs? Oh yeah, we do. Look at these books. I love the creativity of their courses. I've said this already, but it just shines through every time. All right, here we go. Look at this thing. That's gonna shrink that ball down. How about we let it come back and see if that goes a hole in one? Nah, that's not gonna happen. Nope. Oh no, I hit that by accident. Damn it. Damn it. Are you serious? Not doing good, not doing good. Yeah, this is not working well. We're messing up. There we go. I didn't even realize that we were already on hole 12. Time flies when you're having fun. I said I was only going to do the first few of them, and we ended up doing a few more. But uh, I will let you guys explore the end of this, uh, even though we did a few more holes than I expected. So you guys can take a look at the last uh, you know, few holes for yourself. But you can see the creativity of this thing. God knows what's lurking up there and where these spiders are that apparently get turned off in the settings and stuff. Uh, but yeah, the creativity on here is awesome, as you guys can see with their holes and stuff like that. Uh, the mansion looks fantastic, the graphics look great, I can't wait to see their Quest 3 update, and, uh, and you know, what that's gonna look like and stuff. Um, but they, they did a great job, obviously, uh, with the, with these courses and stuff, so I hope you guys enjoyed a little bit of the gameplay to let you guys know what it is. Uh, as always, you can buy this for $3.99, and if your friends already have it, you don't even need to rebuy it, you can also play it, only one person needs to own it. Uh, fantastic job by the devs for allowing that to happen and uh, yeah uh, check it out guys the, the DLC is out now walkabout mini golf widows walkabout if you guys have any questions about anything you guys have seen here today as always leave it down below if not thank you guys for watching until next time